People have a tendency to collect things that no longer serve them. Do you know what's a healthy activity? Purging. Think about it. We have rooms and rooms full of shit, and all it does is weigh us down. If you have a sentimental connection to something, it's really not the object that you love. It's the feeling about the object that's special. We have many years of experiences on this planet, and we also have many years to accumulate things. These things have a tendency to bury us, and we can lose our true selves in the process. We let things define us and our lives. Some people think that their belongings give them status, like they are better than others because they have more. But really, what they have more of is stuff that buries them, stuff to hide behind, and stuff that weighs them down. It's just a facade. Let's be real, we have limited space here. So why are we being brainwashed to be good little consumers? It's all about money, status, and stuff. And that's sad. I recently moved to a new house and I needed to downsize. I gave truckloads of my things away, but my art was not included. Burning paintings can be looked at as crazy, wasteful, dark, aggressive, or even evil. This is the complete opposite of where my heart truly is. My intentions are to let go of what no longer serves me. My paintings were created with love. It does them an injustice to store them in a dark basement and let them get old and moldy. It would be disrespectful to them if I were throwing them in the garbage and letting them rot in a landfill. It would be disrespectful to me and it would devalue my art if I were to donate them. I could give my paintings away, but many of these paintings were not my best works. It would embarrass me for someone to hang one of my paintings on their wall that I'm not proud of. So I honor them by burning them. I set them free. I send them up to the moon with sparks of light, and I trust that the love and energy that went into them will recycle and come back to me in a form more intense than before. I trust that my best works will not make it, and I believe that I'm an open channel for inspiration to flow. All of this because I choose to let go. Those paintings are things, and they no longer serve me. It's so easy to be misunderstood. Society puts parameters on what is the norm, and people just want to be loved. And in order to have this love and approval, you have to fit in. If you're a person that strives to be real and honest, then being your true self comes with the risk of being rejected. It takes strength to show the world who you really are. I'm communicating this strong belief of mine right now. Some may be disturbed by it. Some may totally get it. To conclude this story, I am being real. <laughs>